Hi, this is State Senator Lana Tice. It's March's Reading Month, and I would normally be in your classroom, and I would love to be there, but unfortunately this year that's just not possible. Hopefully, I'll be able to do that next year. I am reading Smelly Bill. Bill the dog loved smelly things, like muddy ponds and rubbish bins. Disgusting stuff he'd stick his snout in, sniff and snort and roll about in. Because of this, he had a bleak and really quite unpleasant reek. His family would cry, you stink, and try to get him in the sink, but every time he'd get away and live to stink another day. A very smelly dog was Bill, and that's the way he stayed until one day his folks went to the beach and left poor Bill with great Aunt Bleach. Now, great Aunt Bleach just loved to clean. On cleaning, she was super keen. With disinfectant, sponge and rubber, vacuum, mop, and gloves of rubber, great Aunt Bleach yelled, Tilly ho! And cleaned the house from tip to toe. When every knife and fork was polished, every dirty mark abolished, Great Aunt Bleach said, what's that smell? And that is when she spotted Bill. Bleach twittered, come on, doggy woo. It's bathy wathy time for you. Bleach was fast, but Bill was faster. Like a flash, he dashed right past her. He knew exactly what to go for. He scrambled underneath the sofa. Just out of reach from Bleach, he knew that there was nothing she could do. He snuggled up that cheeky chap and settled down to take a nap. When Bill woke up before his eyes, he saw a steak of mammoth size. It was a lovely juicy thing. It got him all a dribbling. Bill slid from underneath the seat and sank his teeth into the meat. It was a trick. Bill had been fooled. Bleach wound and pulled and wound and pulled until she had that smelly pet caught within her fishing net. Then with a laugh, Bleach filled the bath until the bath was brimming. And while she tipped in smelly stuff, Bill heard the old girl singing. Oh, fizzy lilac scented balls, please hear the words I'm speaking. Oh, apple blossom, lemon zest, cherry scrub, and all the rest, please do your very smelly best to stop this beast from reeking. While Bleach was busy with her chants, Bill struggled from the net. He saw the window, seized his chance, and out to freedom leapt. Across the yard, he had to race to find the perfect hiding place. He dug down deep, down deep within a very smelly compost bin. But oh, too late, Bleach spotted him. She wasted very little time in climbing to the washing line, yelled, Bill, you will not get away. And like a great plump bird of prey, she swooped down to the compost bin and landed right on top of him. Game over, doggy wuggy woo. It's bathy wathy time for you. And when they returned, the family were most surprised and pleased to see a fluffy bill from nose to toes, smelling sweeter than a rose. Bleach said, I do not like to boast, but I'm the one to thank. The children didn't get too close. She absolutely stank. <laughs>